My earliest memory of art of any discipline is probably with my parents. They're not collectors, they're not in the art world at all. But my dad used to have, well my parents used to have this um, sheet that was printed with um, squares. And later on in life, I realized that it was a print of, uh, the sheet had Mondrian painted, <laughs> printed on the sheet. And I didn't know about that, but um, that's one of my earliest memories. As well as my parents had prints in my house. Like um, there was a print of uh, this very well-known painting, El Velorio by Francisco Ayer, which is a painting that depicts a special funeral that um, is made for little children when they died in Puerto Rico. Um, and then, so we had a, a small print like, like that. And then we also had uh, another print by uh, Talor Dali. I, I don't think if he actually made the print, because again, they're not collectors, but it was a picture of Abraham Lincoln. So those were some of my first memories of art growing up. Well, that's pretty powerful stuff. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, uh, my parents, you know, they, um, my grandparents converted in both sides to baptism, you know, when the Baptists and the Americans were kind of colonizing or transculturizing Puerto Rico. And they grew up in very strict Baptist um, households and actually have family members that have found churches in Puerto Rico and all that good stuff. And so they grew up in those strict environments and they, they both did not get baptized. They both like, you know, kind of, were had a little bit of spirits and and were very much engaged or liked the arts and especially my dad my dad you know who's still alive um he loves literature that's like his thing